Welcome to my home studio tour. So I wanted to make this video for the longest time. Uh, I wanted to all show you uh, that I'm actually shooting my beauty in what used to be a living room in my house. I want to show you, give you a proper tour, show you what I have, how it's all sorted, what gear I'm using, which is probably, this is probably the only gear related video you'll ever see from me because I'm not really a gear person. Anyway, uh, this is the biggest room in the house. We have a two bedrooms, two bathrooms, big kitchen and this huge what used to be living room. So I decided to just change it into studio. Okay, so let's talk about the beginnings. Before this whole room was dedicated to be a studio, uh, I had just a little corner when I was taking all my shots because I didn't have many shoots uh, back then, it was like three years ago. Then I started to have a little more clients and the way it was set for me that I had to always put my lights out and then put them back in, it, it wasn't a good solution long term. So then I dedicated half or like a quarter of this room uh, to a studio. Uh, makeup corner used to be behind me, here when the camera is there used to be a backdrop and I had my lights out all the time so it took me literally no time to set everything for a shoot and then put it back and clean everything and make it like look nice again but still we had a little part of the room dedicated to kind of like living room space, my office space and, and all the stuff and now uh, lockdown happened so I thought it's a great opportunity to change this again uh, dedicated completely only to a studio so I moved the makeup corner now it's close to the window so there is a beautiful natural light which uh, makeup artists will be very happy about um, but you see it's still not completely ready like here behind me and uh, there's a empty frame that's waiting to be filled there next to my table is also an empty board that also waiting for some ideas to be pinned in there uh, so it's still a work in progress but it's so close to the where i want it to be that i decided to show you also today is my birthday so i decided why not to show you something that i'm proud of because i'm proud of this even though it's just a living room made in the studio uh, it's in my home uh, doesn't matter you don't have to have fancy big studio or tons of gear or super expensive equipment to create something amazing and take some great pictures. So let's have a look what we have here. So let's start from this part. Here is a little flower <laughs> with my business cards and actually in this shell I have some books and inspirational magazines and all that stuff related to photography. Um, here I have like the essential things like the hairspray and all the stuff that uh, we can use sometimes in the shoot. Here's just a bunch of cables and extensions and all the stuff that I need but it looks horrible when it's somewhere so it needs to go in the box. Um, all my pictures that I'm most proud of, I'm regularly changing them all the time. Here's a mirror and my vanity light that I can actually like change the colors. I'm not sure if you can see it now. You can change the brightness of them and you can change the temperature of them. Oh, they're awesome. This is the makeup corner with the beautiful window light. Whenever I shoot, I have this little like holder. So I just mount it here on the side of the table uh, and put my tablet on it. Uh, it's a viewing station. There's a server capture pilot from a capture one that I'm using and I'm always showing the pictures straight away. I'm on this side. So here's my backdrop on the wall. It's not completely to the floor, but I don't really need it. Um, I have this little rack here that I'm going on my backdrops whenever I need to change the color. So I have a bunch of multiple colors. You can buy this in an art shop. It's A1 size and it's perfectly uh, fine for the beauty. I have 
uh, two more of these big ones. They are over here in the corner. They are gray and the black whenever I need to change it. Here's my light. It's a Nuver S300N and I have my beauty dish on it. These are two modifiers that I use all the time. Here is a small Octabox with the diffuser. Here's a honeycomb if I need for my beauty dish. Uh, I have more modifiers. They are stored in my storage room um, because I don't need them that often. And I also have a different light. It's hidden there under the sofa <laughs> and all the other things that I need here. This little table is a posing table. It's not the original music table. This is actually from some rock jam band. It's meant to hold your notes it's for in musical instruments, but works just fine for my as, as a beauty posing table or any posing table really. So works. Then here is the seating area, kind of like waiting area or whenever we are between the looks or take a we want to take a little break or model comes with a friend or something. I have an empty frame here as I mentioned, just waiting for some pictures to be put in. And here are uh, other of my favorite images. If you just look around my studio, so here are the frames, here's going to be a picture, pictures all the way over there. So pictures everywhere, really. We are moving into my last area and that is my office. Let's just bump up ISO a little bit here. So I have my lenses here. Uh, here is a Sigma 105 macro lens that I'm using for beauty and also my 50 1.4 uh, This camera that I'm shooting with right now. is my Canon 7D Mark II. It's a crop sensor camera So I can still shoot with my 50 millimeter lens uh, Here's some bunch of batteries and and all the stuff that I need regularly and some microphones for YouTube and all the stuff um, underneath there are some things that I don't need as often, but they are necessary to have some you know, some clamps and all that stuff some external hard drive chargers and all the stuff and a bunch of books in here as well Here is my camera Practica BCA. It's my first camera that I ever had. It's here kind of like my baby <laughs> How they found empty <laughs> All right, uh, my desk, let's have a look around. I have my Blue Yeti microphone that I'm recording my tutorials with. Here is a Vacuum Intus uh, S Bluetooth graphic tablet that I'm doing all my retouchings with, with a pen. Um, I'm currently running Mac Mini 2018 in the 2020 version. I have my, I'm, keyboard and mouse obviously my monitor at the moment AOC but Dell one is on the way it's calibrated and it's good but not good enough so I'm still want to update in that area definitely here's just my notebook and um, external hard drive I have another external hard drive here just have a look my daughter uh, it's VD elements for terabytes that goes into electricity that's my backup uh, and also I'm doing a backup on my cloud. Um, here is a tablet that whenever, whenever I don't use it for um, shooting over there, I'll be using it for as my secondary display to my computer if I need to, like put the timeline there while I'm retouching and other stuff. I'm, I'm very happy about how it looks right now. There is enough space for shooting so whenever I pull out my lights and um, there is a plenty of room here so nobody it doesn't feel crowded or anything like that I have my little office station there's a little seating area shooting area and makeup and hair corner so that's it for my little home studio tour hope you enjoyed it if you did give it a like and leave me a comment if you have any questions or you want to congratulate me to my birthday uh, it's I'm hitting free O, oh, the big one. <laughs> so yeah, that's it. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit the little notification bell as well so you don't miss any future uploads. And I'll see you here next time. Bye!